Welcome to the EA Afternoon Minute. So little time and so much to tell you, but let's quickly get to it, right? Minister of Police Beke Kole has assured residents of Port Elizabeth's northern areas that an anti-crime, anti-gang unit would be provided. For years now, gang violence has been rife in the northern areas of PE, which has resulted in related crimes and deaths. Khoisan activist Christian Martin expressed his joy in the assurance that was given by the minister but reminded residents that an anti-gang unit would merely be a stepping stone towards solving the actual problem here, socio-economic issues. Look out, National Prosecuting Authority. There's a new sheriff in town. Was that corny? A little bit. Advocate Shamila Batohi was named National Director of Public Prosecutions yesterday. She will start fulfilling her duties in February next year after she served the last of her notice at the International Criminal Court in The Hague. The new NPA head said she'd be running a tight, reliable ship that is reinforced by strong governance and independence. The National Student Financial Aid Scheme, aka NSFAS, is geared up and ready to help its applicants in the new year. They say already they've received more than 400,000 applications and 100,000 of them meet the criteria. So now their focus will be to ensure that the potential students receive the funds. If you've applied to receive financial aid from NSFAS, you'll find out if your application has been successful or not early next month. And in some light-hearted news, American comedian Kevin Hart will be scratching off yet another thing from his bucket list when he hosts the next Oscars. Talk show host Jimmy Kimmel hosted the 2017 and 2018 awards, while greats such as Chris Rock and Whoopi Goldberg have also hosted before. Nominations will be coming out on the 22nd of January, and the actual show itself will be aired on the 24th of February. Okay now, get ready folks. I know it's only Wednesday, but I have to tell you this in advance. This weekend is going to be jam-packed with sporting action. The box will be facing England on Saturday. The Proteas will head down under to face Australia in an ODI series that begins on Sunday. Liverpool and Arsenal go head-to-head -head in the Premier League on Saturday. And while spirits are high, speed will be high too in the Malaysian Grand Prix on Sunday. So be on your mark. Yo, don't you want to step a little bit back? No. Yo, that's intense, bro. Oh, that's better. And that's all we have for you today, folks. But join us again next time for some more news. By now, I'm sure you know what to do. Spread the word.